Voices Against Corruption. Let the people speak. Hello, I am Esther Bassi and it's Voices Against Corruption, a production of Primorg. In this episode, we ask, do you think the government is doing enough to secure and protect the welfare and education of the girl child in Nigeria? As far as I can understand the situation in Nigeria, I don't think government has done anything special to protect or to enhance the education of a, a girl child. It's like everybody is left on its own, both the male and the female. The government may have done their best, but the question might be the best may not be substantial enough to keep the girl child protected in Nigerian school. Government have been trying because they've brought out some schools. They've established schools in the northern part of the country to enable children, girls, to go to school, to have education, quality education. The government cannot be everywhere. The only thing that the government needs to do in this point in time is to give the local government power to secure their environment. I don't really think that the government is the, government is the problem of, of bringing up a, a girl child. Deliberate effort should be made um, in uh, regards to their protection and safety in the school, looking at um, <clears throat> where the society have actually placed, placed the girl child on their own, really. Um, they might not be able to do anything on their own except the government will make a deliberate effort in their protection and care. See what is happening in Zafara. Go to Plateau. Go all over there. North East, Northwest. Kidnappers are still operating. It's unfortunate. Government should think well about this issue. A girl today is a woman of tomorrow. That woman of tomorrow is a mother of tomorrow. If you educate the girl child well, both morally, educationally, and otherwise, at the long run, we will have a better nation. Fox Public Feedback on Corruption in Nigeria is produced with support from Makato Foundation.